taking a quick trip to Pennsylvania this weekend. All set to go. Well, almost all set. We need to make sure there's enough oil in the car because it's old. It's dry. 270,000 miles on it and a myriad of problems. I'm afraid that this engine is on its last legs, which at 270,000 miles is not surprising. But what it means practically is that I just need to top it off with oil every once in a while. amazing thing there's so much like it smells like a bouquet of flowers it smells like we're in the middle of a bouquet of flowers we're kind of in York right now about about an hour to go we're here It's got a tree and a swing set. Is that Jackie? Slide. Yes, that's Jackie. Uh -huh. and with there's, lipstick. And there's that with lipstick. With right. lipstick. And there's Uncle Adam. And there's and Jackie. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Who's that? I think oh. that was me. Oh yeah. That's Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Let's draw. Here. Yeah. Okay. Over okay, here. Thank you. you can have the purple one. Wait, I was doing the purple one. You're doing the purple one? And don't forget the sky. Wayback Burger. Get me some fries. Yeah. So Jackie wanted a little broom with a little dustbin. So we're at the dollar store. Green is very nice. This is another kind. Tacky. Look at that. It has a little bit more of a handle. Okay, I have one more handle. You like that better? Yeah. Okay. When I was a little kid, there was a pair of cowboy boots and a leather vest that I loved. I wore them all the time. And now we're here back at my parents' house. Guess who found them? Here comes daddy with the camera. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm on my way to Leesport to do a quick errand, and then I'm gonna get a haircut on the way back, and then I'm going to help my dad do a quick photo shoot this afternoon, but first, a necessary stop on any trip to Pennsylvania. Sheets. Don't judge. All right, haircut in three, two, one. Boom, look at that, all right. Ooh, looking good.
that about does it for this trip. We're about ready to pack up and head home. Uh, I'm really digging this haircut. This is it's looking good. Thank you, Sabrina at Bell Tower Salon and Spa. Nice job. So one thing I didn't mention is one of the reasons we came here this weekend was because my, da my dad got bit in the face by a pit bull. Uh, it was superficial. Uh, he got a good chunk taken out of his nose. A plastic surgeon was able to patch him up pretty well and he got lucky that it wasn't more serious. Um, as far as we can tell, it wasn't an aggressive act by the dog. It was an accident, but nonetheless, pit bulls start conversations. Uh, you know, lots of people have strong opinions about the breed for good reason. When I was growing up, uh, I wasn't a big fan of dogs. That's not the case anymore, but I'm a little surprised that I don't have much of an opinion about it, to be honest, because uh, I just didn't like dogs when I was a kid. Um, now we have a great dog, Cooper. Uh, he's super friendly and I, I love dogs, but pit bulls, uh, lots of people think that it's just inappropriate for um, for pit bulls to be pets because they're so dangerous. Other people think they are the sweetest, most gentle dogs that you can find. Um, so tell me what you think. Write some comments about pit bulls. Should we, should we love them? Should we get rid of them? What do, what do you think? Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Uh, peace out.